Howdy folks, uh, pretty excited to share our first model which we have built after unboxing. It's called Gyro Boy. Uh, it's out of the box model and pre-programmed sort of stuff. We have not touched anything on the uh, program which came along. But definitely a lot of fun to build this and it's much more fun to see this stuff in action. It's a neat combination of sensors. You have color sensor, ultrasonic, gyro sensor and a touch sensor and motor so pretty much everything you're using here except uh, the additional touch sensor which come in the box um, with the gyro sensor it, it, it attempts to kind of you know, stand on its own right now it's sitting on a, it's right now it's sitting on a stand and the color sensor is designed to take commands like uh, for forward backward rotation movements ultrasonic is there to uh, see any obstructions on the way and course correct itself so with that, I think like let's uh, let's directly jump into how it looks. Once you're on it, keep it stable so that you know once it sends the kind of stable movement, then only it it, it kind of picks up. Otherwise, it keeps being in a in a, in a sleep mode. Uh, so as you could see, it has it has been attempting to stabilize itself. Pretty neat. Uh, and it's, it's, it's right on its feet um, so let's quickly demo uh, the color combinations if I actually you know do an obstruction uh, it would actually here you go so if I if I actually you know put sort of an obstruction in the ultrasonic sensor it, it tries to make a turn and course correct itself um, and here you go if I give him one of the blue or yellow colors yellow color would make it go counterclockwise and it keeps rotating unless you hit an interrupt and make it stop similarly uh, the blue color would make it go clockwise <clears throat> and it'll, it'll keep doing that unless you you know hit an interrupt with the red button or any other command so let it rotate completely and I'll, uh, I'll, I'll give you a quick demo on what other colors you can play around with. Uh, with the white color it can take the reverse movement. So the moment you will give it it will start going back and if you hit the red it would, it would just freeze right there and if you hit the green it will start to come forward. Uh, and if you give him an interrupt it would actually in a course correct itself again assuming there is something on the way and the same thing you could do with that again so here's a pause and that's pretty much it and I think it's definitely a lot of fun uh, please definitely give it a try and if you have any questions let me know and we can uh, provide more details uh, I, I think all the instructions are right there in the kit uh, all the parts are there the stand is a little bit tricky uh, so you know it doesn't really hold very good on it and more importantly uh, there are some tricky parts when you actually end up building it so you might want to be just a little careful when you plug in the hands and you know and, and make it work with the small motor I think that's the only tricky area but I'm pretty sure you'll figure it out there's nothing really much to worry about so with that we'll upload more stuff once we you know give a hands-on on the programming ourselves and I'll let you know how it goes thanks for watching